gathered only a few of us here in the Meltzer Auditorium, we do so to unveil Dr. Foster's portrait. Dr. Foster, your portrait will now join those of other giants in ophthalmology. It is also a wonderful tribute to you and your lifetime of contributions to ophthalmology and your devotion to patient care, research, and teaching in ocular immunology and cornea. He is a generous mentor. He doesn't hold back his knowledge. He really tells you uh, everything he knows. He doesn't uh, waffle about his decision making. And so you come out of his fellowship with a very clear understanding of how to take care of patients and then the ability to apply that. He was a fantastic role model both for how to treat difficult situations and difficult patient encounters, how to advance the science in this field. And from every perspective, he was just the epitome of an ideal mentor. I'm delighted that today we are recognizing Dr. Stephen Foster's many contributions to ophthalmology and to Mass Ioneer with an official portrait. The portrait is a gift from the Foster Ocular Immunology Society, a group of Dr. Foster's former fellows. I'm happy today to share my admiration for Dr. Foster and appreciation of his commitment to our department, institution, and profession. I was a fellow here in year 2000 to 2001 and Dr. Foster was a, a stern, um, demanding, but generous and, and very knowledgeable mentor. Steve really has to be congratulated for being able to move us into the next level, understanding how best to manage patients. Uh, it may have happened on its own as drugs became uh, more available, but Steve certainly accelerated the pace and uh, and brought us into the next century in a way. As a resident and then a fellow at Mass Ioneer and Retina, I benefited from Dr. Foster's teaching. Dr. Foster was always willing to help with a patient and always acknowledged a hardworking resident or fellow. His dry sense of humor, especially when combined with Dr. Charlie Regan's sp sparkling demeanor, helped us all get through his monster uveitis clinics. Steve has made seminal contributions to the field and I would group them into three major areas. First, he pioneered the use of a range of immunomodulatory drugs for the treatment of ocular inflammatory disease, from ocular cicatricial pemphigoid to panuveitis. Second, he has advocated for achieving remission of ocular inflammation by avoiding dependency on corticosteroids. And his third major contribution really comes from his passion for teaching. He has trained ocular immunologists for several decades who've gone on to practice and teach across the United States and around the world, including many leaders in the field. He has continued to be a teacher, a mentor, not only then but now, uh, and uh, has given me advice on a number of occasions. And I think many of us, um, typical to say if anyone knows, Steve does. So we uh, use him as a resource often. It is with great pleasure and honor that I'm here today representing the FOIS Board of Directors uh, and the members to dedicate this portrait of Dr. Charles Stephen Foster. Dr. Foster, speaking on behalf of FOIS, thank you for all your teachings and wisdoms. We will forever be grateful. touched beyond belief that the fellows did this and that Joan allowed it to be, be done and that uh, we've now got some real estate on the walls here. It's an honor. Um, it's amazing. I think that um, it's well deserved. It has an amazing history and saved many people's vision, including myself. It's interesting that after all these years and all the trainees, I still have that uh, tremendous devotion to the next one that comes along. So Dr. Foster, I would like to offer you my, my warmest congratulations on a well-befitting honor for somebody who has been at this institution and established the paradigms for how we treat inflammatory diseases. Um, I feel that it's appropriate and a befitting honor to have you memorialized in this manner uh, with all of the greats of Mass Ioneer in the third floor Hall of Fame.
Thank you, Dr. Foster, for your teachings and wisdom. I am forever grateful for all that you've done for me. I will always be grateful to you, and I think you have uh, left a legacy for myself as well as others which cannot be repeated by anyone else, very easily at least. So thank you and very appreciative of your mentorship and your knowledge uh, and your strength. Thank you for teaching me what I know, allowing me to pursue the career that I enjoy so much, allowing me to help my patients in ways that I wouldn't have been able to help them if you hadn't taught me what you've taught me. And thank you, uh, congratulations on your portrait.